Hey everybody, welcome back to our channel. I'm Natasha and this demonstration today is being done on my five-year-old daughter's hair, Shama. See guys, the snap. Okay, so her hair has already been washed and cleaned. And now I'm applying the Curl Love Moisture Milk to her hair in sections. And I do her hair differently um, each time. This time I decided to um, apply the leave-in conditioner in sections as I was going instead of applying it all at one time. So right now I am just giving it a light detangle. I had already thoroughly detangled it, but I like to go back in with the leave-in condi conditioner and get it all the way through her hair, make sure it's saturated through all of her strands and getting it prepped and primed and ready to apply the gel. And I'm just showing you right here the curls and I'm gonna give you a quick little loop check. <laughs> so let's get started. We are separating the hair here, applying the curl maker. This, this, this gel is very slimy. It reminds me of the Kinky Curly Curling Custard and my favorite of all times, the Uncle Funky Daughter's Curly Magic. It has that like same like consistency, the sticky, um, gulpy feeling to it. And so I'm just applying it here. I usually do like probably four pumps each little section because I like to get it real, you know, saturated in the hair and make sure I'm getting it to the roots and all the way distributed throughout the ends of their hair. And see, I'm using my fingers, this technique right here to clump the curls like it's a comb, but I'm using my fingers. I guess you can call it like a raking um, technique. And I like to go back through all of it and just make sure that the product is on, you know, covering every strand of her hair. It's more of a raking and smoothing technique. Raking and smoothing. I do like the Curl Love Moisture Milk because it does not contain, it's one of the few products that does not contain your coveted coconut oil and glycerin and shea butter. And I try to stay away from those ingredients in products or the products that have those ingredients in it because I don't like the way they act on our hair, especially living here in Florida with this humidity and it's, it's being so hot. The glycerin and all that stuff is just coconut oil. Coconut oil with our hair being a little porosity, it makes our hair hard and the glycerin, it just swells our hair up and then, um, what was the other ingredient I said? The shea butter is just so heavy and it weighs the hair down. So yeah, you know, curly girl hair problems. <laughs> and make sure that when you're doing your hair or your children's hair, make sure you rinse your hands or get something to wipe your hands off in between applying the products to get shed hairs off and extra product to start with a new application. I, I find that that works best. And so the thing I found out with this gel is that it does make your hair look good overall. And um, you see, as you can see here, you have, it has that look. Um, her curls are not as clumped as with some other um, products I've used, but overall it looks nice. But the true test is in how long will it hold up? How many days can I get out of this hair? That is the question. Time to sleep them edges, baby. <laughs> Gotta lay them the baby hairs. I use I like to have a, a user edge control on her edges because you know our edges, our edges be needing all the help they can get because poor edges, the poor edges get snatched first. <laughs> and so we're done. She um, likes to put on her little headbands when I'm finished with her hair. She, if I don't put a headband on. You'll find her in my room looking for her headband. She loves her headbands on. So I'm applying her headband here and I'm gonna let use it to kind of hold it back out of her face and let it air dry. And that's what most times what I usually do with her hair is let it air dry. Bye. So this is day two hair. And as you can see, 
she put her headband on herself y'all this morning what i did was i put it up in a high ponytail with a satin scrunchie turn around shama her curls are still intact they're soft um she got a little frizz but not too bad Ooh. Turn around. Turn. <laughs> See, the, the curls are still intact a little, but it's just swollen and poofy. Sorry. So, it's going in a ponytail today. It but I'm going to do a car. Okay. Didn't last, but what I did okay. on Sunday today is Tuesday. I can do that too. No, you can't. I'm going to put in a yes, ponytail. Yes, I can. Now. Let me try. 